Hi, I'm Mikey and you're watching City Lights on Novus TV. Tonight is the 10th annual Mighty Asian Movie Marathon here at the International Village. It's down to the top four. Who's going to walk away the winner? This year as a bonus, the audience gets to vote on the best of the best for the past nine years. So, let's see what's going on. So you're one of the founders of this event tonight. Tell us how it started. Oh, well, um, we started about 10 years ago and it was an idea to sort of uh, find more filmmakers here in, in, in Vancouver and bring awareness to the Vancouver Asian Film Festival. We thought we'd start a contest and uh, happily it's been around for 10 years. How has it evolved over the past 10 years? When we started, it was a matter of getting awareness. So I would try to find as many teams as possible. And then over time, as Grace took over, there was more of a, a developmental component. It was meant for a networking aspect to bringing all the filmmakers together in Vancouver. And finally, have you ever put any submissions in yourself? I've been on the board and uh, as an executive and we, we can't. I'm going to have to drop everything and not participate and then I, I, I might put a team together. <laughs> we'll have to see that one year then. Yes, all right. What is MAMM, MAM? MAM stands for the Mighty Asian Movie Making Marathon and it's a short filmmaking contest uh, which has a little bit of an Asian Canadian focus I should say because in the rules it states that out of your team members you need to have one or two that are Asian and out of your lead actors at least one of them has to be Asian. The contest is only for 10 days. So you have to pitch your film, shoot it, edit it, and do all the post-production, all the music and everything in 10 days and submit it. And also, I know you're having a bit of a retrospect tonight and there's going to be audience participation. Yes, there is. Because it's MAM 10 and MAM has been around for 10 years now, we are actually screening all of the top placed winners from the previous nine years. And we're giving the audience a chance to vote. So they'll have five minutes to visit our website and click on which film they, they like and at the end of that time, there will be a best of the best. How did you guys get together for this particular event? We just came up with a story in the cafe and we pitched it to our bosses and then, yeah, here we go. And then we make the film in a week. you went through making the film? It was just about creating an art piece and sharing it with people. You've got all these talented performers, actors, grips, camera people in Vancouver, and when you're sitting around waiting for work, what do you do? Invest your talents into a collective community and create and share and inspire others. That's why we're here. Boom. I just want to make people laugh. So hopefully, I think out of all, all the movies you're going to see today, guaranteed that you're going to laugh your, your ass off. So. so second place goes to Team T. GK Films. Woo! Woo! First place goes to Team Chow Thai House. Stick with you. Okay, so congratulations to you guys, the winners. How do you guys feel? Surprised. surprised. Overwhelmed. Surprised. surprised. Why are you so surprised? Personally, I think the other team does a better job than us. <laughs> Actually. Modesty. Yeah, no. the, it's the Chinese culture. Congratulations to this year's winners. If you'd like to participate next year, go to vaf.org for all the details. Like any great film event, there's got to be an after party, and the mighty Asian movie marathon is no different. That's where we're headed. I'm Mikey Evers, and you're watching City Lights on Novus TV.